Hello everyone, me and Luke, who rode up on a trail to get to the first Mystery Monday geocache today. We have a total of 12 geocaches that we're going for, that we are going to use for Mystery Monday. You will see these over the next 12 weeks. They're perfect. They're one question, one answer. And that's why we're going to use them for Mystery Monday. So, let's get our day started. Let's get up on a trail. Let's meet Luke. And let's go bring you today's Mystery Monday cash. Loaded up on the bike. We are within 119 feet from parking of cash number one today. Where do we go? Guess we go around this way. Am I on an opposite trail or something? <laughs> you think it's here? Huh. Well, I guess we're around here somewhere. Let's look and bring you your Mystery Monday. All right, now for today's Mystery Monday. Really simple. Luke's going to ask you a question. I'm going to give you a hint. And then, well, I'm going to give you two hints. I'm going to be nice today. And then we'll show you the three possibilities of answers and see if you can pick out the right location based on the answer to the question. That's simple. All right, go for it. Unicorn and Narwhal are two famous carnival-themed bars. Ooh. They're located on Capitol Hill. Ooh. Where's that? Right. That's your question. Two unicorn names made into bars which sound really spectacular like yeah they're themed around these names apparently yeah if you ever get to the city check them out because they sound interesting Th you know like a, a mystical themed bar yeah it really just sounds well now here's a hint i right, said so i'm going to give you two so i'm going to give you two hint number one used to be a tree hint number two it's a city. Mm. So all you got to do to answer this question. Which one of the three locations used to be a tree and is a city? Clearly, I think we eliminated one right off the bat. But you won't know until we show you the three selections you have to choose from right now. All right. You start the trail... You can either come up the ADA accessible ramp or you can do, do the steeper one. Of course, you see me ride up the ADA accessible ramp because I'm a little handicapped today. Mentally, not physically. Because uh, <laughs> I don't know what the heck I have planned on doing today except for geocaching. <laughs> so right here at the signpost, you come down and you've seen Luke poking around. Will you find this container? At location number one, if the answer to the question is Washington, D.C., just past the sign off the trail, there's a geo trail here. Do you walk up to the base of this tree for location number two? And if the answer is Oklahoma, you will find this geocache in location number two. All right. Option number three, or location number three. In from the trail, past location two, come around, and you have what's left of a railroad tie. Move the tie, lift up the rock, there's your container. If you think it's location number three, your answer for the question would be 
Seattle. All right, folks, that's simple. Answer the question, pick the right location. Where should they put the answer? In the comments below. And if I remember correctly, the answer is going to be pinned to the top. Right. right. I was just going to say, while you're putting your answer below, in ROT 13, pinned to the top of the comments for you to decipher is the answer. Good luck, and I hope you enjoyed today's Mystery Monday. And now, we continue to bring you 11 more. <laughs> See you next Monday you next for week. Mystery Monday. See you. Happy trails, happy caching, go get a smiley. <laughs>